All right, so very good chance this connects. Connect again, baby. Nice, once more, yes. That is so broken, dude. That is so gross, guys. That's legit really gross. You just clear the whole board and deal so much damage. Hey, buddy, watch this. Hand me my hat, Finn. It's Reno. Do we try this nonsense? See how good this is? Um, what's the best support for Hero Power Reno? I mean, I think Secrets is probably the most fun, but I don't know if it's the most synergistic. In a weird way, I think Lay Flame Paw makes a lot of sense because you can get Wildfire and then... Like, if you have Wildfire multiple times, doesn't that make your hero power even more insane? You want something to finish? I feel weird building a hero power and then having a different hero power replace it, right? I feel like I want... Da if I'm going to commit to building a damage output, I don't want to pivot into, like, a value... I mean, I know treasures can deal damage, but they also often are just, like, value pieces. Do I really want to pivot over to value pieces or do I want to keep rolling damage? So, like, I don't know. I think, like, Magical Torch or Lay make more sense to me, though. Part of me likes Torch pretty well because it's just more damage output. Like, it's finishing utility. If you get card draw and Torch, aren't you going to just blow people up? I'm going to take Torch for now. We're, I, I'm way more excited to do the Tomb Diver stuff, for the record. But here's my thought. If I don't do this hero power now and it's broken, I may never get to do it again. Like, this might be my only chance to play it if it gets nerfed or something. So I want to play the best stuff. Speaking of which, I, I guess we're going to build this for, like, a lot of damage, right? Is this just going to go face a lot? Is that the best way to utilize this hero power? Or do I need, like, some board clears and freezes and stuff as well? I'm thinking between rogue and mage, we probably have a lot of damage output, right? Arcane spells? Yeah, I do I do think that made sense. Yeah, I liked that. Getting sheep was pretty sneaky good, yeah. I mean, is this the right mix of generation and draw and damage output? Is is what I'm worried about. I need enough draw, but I also need enough damage. Doesn't rogue have card draw? Yeah, actually that's a good point. Maybe rogue card draw is a little bit more reliable. Swindle's kinda cool. Swindle could find me a Mordresh. Yeah, that's that's actually a better idea, isn't it? Let's get some rogue card draw going. I think with Secret Passage and Swindle, I can actually run more damage again. Yeah, I like tradable. Fire sale's not bad either, actually. Kind of like a fire sale. Just to have some AoE removal other than Mordresh, in case we fall behind a little bit. Still retain some card draw, but could also soften up the board for hero powers and stuff. I'm worried that running the fire spell might trigger fire synergies but i already got wildfire it should be fine all right i have no idea i have no idea <laughs> it's either gonna be completely broken or utterly utterly garbage get rid of frostbolt that's a good point i did add it early i think there might be better damage outputs i do like freezing a lot in duels usually <sighs> That's that heal thing, right? I don't know what to mulligan for. Primordial Studies works. No, I didn't run Cutlass. I don't I don't want to have to rely on attacking too much. I mean, the trading is fine. Discounting is fine. But all my stuff's really cheap anyway, so... I feel like I'd get diminishing returns there pretty quickly. Yeah, Trader's cool. Trader might have been good with Garot. Classic combo. Mm -hmm. Oh, I think we just... Do we hero power? Probably wait till we get wildfires to make hero power more compelling, right? Portal's fine. Get a body, play it, play it. Oh, that's good, though. That's a nice one mana play. Combo with Reno's, too, is really good. We're going to just kill them in, like, two turns, dude. Like, Reno's is insane. This is really nuts. Great one mana minion. I mean, what did this cost, actually? Three total? I don't swindle yet, right? I think we just start shipping the damage in. It's gonna be a, well, like we want to put a good card in our deck, right? It's a great card. We want to draw it as soon as we can, so let's put it in as soon as we can. This is still good next turn. Wow, armor gain. I love it. It's a battle here. <laughs> That's funny. Um, 
Yeah. Okay. I know the plan here, man. I gotta find wildfire. I gotta find damage. I know the plan. A lot of damage as soon as we get hero powers pumped up. Uh, this isn't bad next turn, actually. I might just hit for six again. Like, I don't think their armor gain is going to be able to keep up, right? I don't know. We have priest cards and druid cards. That can be pretty defensive. Did they play this the same turn they moonlit guidance did? No, right? No. So they don't have another one of those. It's important to know. Probes are gross. That could be a lot of damage, too. All right, we're going. <laughs> I have absolutely zero chill. Just go face, man. I don't know. So it's a body on board, too, right? So it's it's kind of good, I think. Zero chill. Play a taunt heal thing, and I'm just going to devolve it. Hit you for six again. Chat likes it. Smork, they say. Ooh. Not comboed, though. Hmm. They had to do it for solar, I guess. Like a lunar or something. Oh, Frostbolt. That's cool. It's a nice way to deal with Cariel. It's a fun turn. I guess you could have done it the other way around, though, and gotten gotten the torch shuffled in, right? Would have been the same difference. Oh, no, no, because Guild Trader was four. Well, yeah, but you could have played that last. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe they didn't want it in their deck. Maybe they rather preferred... Um, they might have preferred other options, right? So this is theoretically a lethal setup. Because <sighs> I have five next turn. Same difference here, I guess. So let's Frostbolt now in case they have some kind of attack. They're a druid, right? I don't know. Might, might clear the minion or something. I haven't really enabled Mordrush at all, but, but I just haven't had Wildfire, so. Oh, wow. They break the freeze. Not that it matters here, it looks like. But they break the freeze. And they lunar my dude. Your kind of stream is uh, Thursday. <laughs> oh, dude, I love it. We were talking about playing this. Wait, they didn't really. I don't think they've had a friendly minion die, right? Am I crazy? This is lethal. Oh, no, it's not lethal yet with Torch, but it's close. Uh, We don't passage this then, do we? I think we just stab. Set up for Passage Lethal next turn. Yeah, they got a heal or deal 20 here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't, did it ramp them at all? I don't remember a minion dying, I guess. I mean, it could have. I wasn't really paying that much attention, but I guess I don't remember it. Oh, wow. That's cool, dude. They got giga ramp in this deck. I love it. Dude. Dude. They're out of cards, but they have 19 mana. What's what's the last card? Oh, Feral Rage is pretty good, dude. They got fatigue problems, though. Uh, I only go to eight for Mordresh, right? So that's what well, I'm mana anyway. So let's just ship this face. They're taking one off fatigue. Theoretically, Blizzard keeps me alive pretty well for a turn. I guess I can sap an Azure Drake. Kind of does the same thing, but saves me a lot of mana. Oh, do we think they have Kazakas on? Oh, they could. You're right. Mm. Oh, shoot. Yeah. <sighs> so they're going to draw a treasure in that case. That means I need to hero power, but I can't really set up a Mordrash either. I still need to set up to win here. I'm just not really getting Mordrash done until two turns later is the problem, right? This hits face twice, I have lethal. It hits face once. Ugh. Okay. So if they go for Kazakasan here, they can draw a treasure. But what's my other draw? What was the other card? Oh, there's a chance I die here, isn't there? Did I have any way to set up a guaranteed lethal? I have Torch and... What was the other card? I can't remember. What else was it? And, oh, Fire Sail? I could trade Fire Sail for lethal, right? As long as I don't heal out of range here. I'm the that doesn't matter. 
Yeah, I can just trade fire cells. It's a guarantee. Cool. Dude, that's crazy. Okay. Wild game. I love their deck. I'm jealous, man. They're playing a cool deck and I'm playing a degenerate deck. I mean, I guess Kazakasan's kind of degenerate these days, isn't it? Yeah, a little degenerate. Yeah, it's probably Arcanite Crystal, right? Unholy Gift definitely doesn't seem like it. Sticky Fingers is not bad for us, but this we have Arcane Spells, so... We'll do Crystal. Ugh. 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 What is this garbage? Shark in the Mordresh. I like it. I think that's where I'm going, just because the card quality is the highest there. It's just, it's just not really particularly synergistic stuff, right? Why did I not think Mordresh would be online? Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I, I think we'd only hero powered once for four, right? And if we hero powered a second time for another four, I, I don't I don't think I ever hit it at one. I don't think we ever got to ten, did we? Maybe, I don't know. Hmm. With a two three? That does sound familiar, yeah, with the with the Panthara. Yeah, that might be it. It is time to Oh my god, the damage. Oh Wildfire on one is insane. Uh yeah, I like this. A little bit of mix of generation, some good arcane stuff to discount. Wildfire on one, that's good. Stab is probably the one thing I could toss here, but it looks good too. Okay. Uh, double secret. Uh, I, I guess I have to coin here for counter spell because otherwise wildfire gets absolutely wrecked. Yeah, okay. Woo! <laughs> Dude, it's not Yogg as well, right? There's no way. There's no way. I don't even know how they work together, but... Okay. Big ol' hero power. I mean, it's gonna be hard not to hit this every turn. Well, I guess that minion is actually kind of... Kind of a low roll for it, but maybe it's still worth it. it there's a good chance we hit it, actually. Not a good chance. Decent chance. Job done. Sets up for next turn that way as well. Yeah, the heroes are out, man. I be in my first 12 win game and therefore missed a lethal because of a paladin secret I didn't notice. That sounds like good Hearthstone to me. All right, so very good chance this connects. Connect again, baby. Nice, once more, yes. That is so broken, dude. That is so gross, guys. That's legit really gross. That is so gross. You just clear the whole board and deal so much damage. It's so busted. Oh no, that's so busted, man. That's so busted. That's not good. <laughs> that's so strong. Oh, dude, this hero power just feeds it to this poor guy. I feel really bad. Um, I mean, I have a lethal, right? But, I mean, this is also pretty much always lethal. Basically by itself. Okay, oh, I feel dirty. Oh my god, I need a triple wildfire bucket, man. <laughs> this is so gross. <laughs> Any minion based deck, if you get wildfire on one, is just forget about it. I, I think I go for this, right? Just faster wildfires. The other cards suck anyway. Uh, Fireball is intriguing. Combustion's not bad. Too much SI action there, I think. <laughs> Reported for bullying, yeah. I think you're right. I mean, I like Fireball going face, but it's pretty expensive stuff. This isn't bad either. Wandmaker could theoretically get me wildfires. Kind of hate how all in this is, though. Not a lot of value passed back. But if I'm hero powering a lot anyway, that might be okay. I think it's the most synergistic. Hey, Salt Gobbler with another five gifted subs. Reno versus Mozaki. Reno versus Mozaki. The greatest weapon of all. We're gonna be rich and save the world. Okay. Uh, Arcane spell discount pass along is pretty decent. I think we hard mulligan otherwise, maybe for wildfire though. Maybe we hard mulligan for wildfire altogether. Uh, maybe we do. It's so good. 
Uh, yeah, Berserk. I think I think I think we do. It's so strong, right? And it's not like other cards are complete failures for us. So we don't we don't have any like super dead hands. I don't think because we have a lot of low cost stuff. So we might as well. Armor, armor, lightly armor. I think. Coin swindled already or trade? Let's trade for now. I doubt we need that against this kind of deck, right? Hey, Silver Fusion. I don't know. I'm trying to get around that pronunciation. Thanks to the Prime Sub. Mind's Eye, thanks to the Prime Sub. 21 months is insane. Appreciate it. What? Excuse me? Wildfire. It's good, too. Arcane spells are good. Is our treasure the first arcane spell? No, it's all arcane spells. Okay, so, you can chain a bunch in one turn. This is good together. Oh, really nice. Wow. Perfect. I don't think we hero power quite yet on this one. We're going to swindle for now. Oh, interesting. Let's wait. That's not really doing a lot at the moment, right? It's kind of chilling for now. We could maybe even siphon mana that or something. Not that I think that's especially good, but a pretty decent discount. I don't want to undervalue base hero power. Like, I think it's still good. Oh my god, Drago! Flammable Dormouse, unless you also dropping subs. Craziness. Hype Train active. You guys are blowing up right now. Thank you, everybody. It's really cool. Battle cries and combos, huh? It's so crazy. It just might work. It just might work. Eh, I don't know. SI7 Agent's pretty cool next turn, I guess. Shadowcaster's probably not as cool, but... Oh, they got a wildfire too. What do you know? Uh, I need to wicked stab a minion here. Oh my god, dude. Okay, okay. Ha, this guy's toast. I believe. Are we gonna hit the? I believe, right? We're gonna hit the. We're gonna hit the zero two. I believe. I personally believe. Nice. Oh, we didn't kill that one, but I'll take it. I'll take it. Now we've got Secret Passage more dresh when we get to the mana point where that's relevant. Uh, oh, well, I guess I still need more work, but, you know, soon, soonish. That's actually better for me. I didn't have anything left for that guy. I mean, I guess Shadowcaster I had left. That's pretty good. Never mind. That would have been pretty nice. So hero power again. Uh, the question is, do I arcane missiles first or maybe even like rune orb first to set up a better hero power? So that, that that I'm increasing my odds of killing this stuff pretty reliably? I think so. Damage, yeah. Damage is good. Aw. Better if we better if we stagger them out, right? But we'll take it. We'll take it. Hey, Money Master dude with a prime sub. Jeez, thank you, Money Master as well, man. Incredible. Alright, so we're stacking up a ton of damage, which is the goal. Um pushing Hero powers as well against these two ones is going to be pretty nice, I think. Could always whiff, but we got arcane missiles to save the day. Nice. Hit it, hit it. Nice. Could be a barrier. I only lose five, though. I think I'm okay with that, honestly. I mean, what do I have for damage output? Five, eight, twelve. Plus four is sixteen. Yeah. Yeah. I think I probably need to attack. It is debatable though, honestly, but I just want to learn what the secret is, if nothing else. It's just, there's there's knowledge upside. I don't have to worry about playing around stuff as much. Spell damage plus two is pretty wild. Yeah, everything's so cheap already. That's kind of crazy. So next turn I have five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so I could passage here for a three mana play. Is there anything that's really good for three mana this turn? Just for lack of anything else to do, I, I think I'm going to do it. Maybe find some card draw. And Evis is great, actually. Yeah, my Apocalypse is great. Pretty good across the board there. That went through, right? Yeah, okay, Mordrush. Also ready. Torch, okay. 
Yeah, that's an insane turn, obviously. Wow, dude, what an insane turn. Okay, I don't know how much... I have a lot of damage. Um, so 6, 11, 14, plus 6 is 20. Looks like enough. Is that enough mana? 5, 6, 7, 8. 5, Oh, a secret could mess things up, actually. Let's see. Also, arcane missiles doesn't all go face because they played minions. So do I actually have enough? Maybe I just take the Mordresh here to be safe. Um, five, seven, eight, nine. I technically still have enough if all of this connects face. You've been in tighter scrapes, Is that enough damage, though? Five, eleven, fifteen, twenty-one. Yeah. Let's see. We may pivot if this dies, for instance, right? A few things here that disrupt me. Oh my god, it's actually Ice Block. What a god, dude. What a god! It's actually Ice Block! Wow! You don't see that every day. Jeez. Okay, cool. This still sets me up. Thankfully, I can clear a little board, feel a little safer that way. Although, I could still be dead, right? I'm sure. Mordrash actually is one off here, so they have mana left over for something else. Oh, Dawngrass Peel? Is that enough? Mordrash still hits nine. Do they get the ice block? I guess is the question, right? Was that a frost one? Fire? Oh my god, that's another ice block, isn't it, bro? Wow. You're actually joking. That's another ice block. Unreal, dude. Oh, it could be barrier. Oh, yeah, they played barrier, too. Oh, yeah, it could be. We got to try, actually, right? Um, is there any reason to hold here? Yeah, it's probably... It's just a 50-50. I lose... It's just a 50-50. There's no... I lose or I win. I win. Okay. Did they miss lethal? Um... I don't know, I wasn't watching, did they? Did they hit a minion instead of face? I was at one. They traded into that 2-2, right? I think they did, yeah. I think they did, yeah. Um, okay, I mean, it's gotta be unstable magic, right? It's just too good. We're all arcane anyway. We like the one ones because they feed our hero power. It's just it's just the pick. I mean, there's no choice. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> More damage. I mean, these aren't arcane, but they are awesome. Here's a new pirate, though. That's fun. Yeah, it's it's more damage. Yeah, I've never played Unstable before. No, this is my first time. Okay, this is busted, man. We got kind of lucky there. They missed lethal, and we got that 50-50 roll, too. Reno! Do we ever keep Secret Passage because it helps me find wildfires somewhat reliably? I don't, I don't think so. Rather just get good stuff, I think. Good stuff is important as well. Mm, this isn't exactly good stuff. I mean, multiple arcane spells is nice, I guess. This is cool if I can discount it enough into a Mordresh. That would be sick. So they got goggles and gem. So they're looking at high tempo output here. Gonna go ham. Also got, like, Scepter summoning style deck. Scepter is now ultra rare, so that's unlikely itself. But, um, yeah, let's save this, actually, because the, the polymorph might be really nice. Let's just weave in some hero powers. Hunter hero power. Wasn't Wandmaker good because it can get you Wildfire? Wandmaker's about a, like, I don't know, 1 in 20 to get Wildfire because you got two classes, so it's super unlikely to get Wildfire. Uh, whereas Mulligan, you know, it's it's more direct, and I just get other cards too. So I get the same chance for Wildfire, but actually probably better, honestly, but, um, you know, other good plays too. Okay. Can try hero power here it's not really likely to clear this but that's okay we'll finish on a primordial if it doesn't it's all good mike might hit it nice zero power is op even when it's not Ooh, this is fun but i think head crack supports our game plan more we like we like damage a lot right okay so we already have like a billion damage look at this it's actually already so much whoa sure would be a shame if somebody polymorphed that Portal's arcane, yeah. I love it. 
Oh, we missed. You serious? Is this for real? I'm not that worried about a 1-1 one, one, though. Just squeezing some face damage. Okay. Going ham here. Oh, well, that needs to get polymorphed. So... Probably a little better off, like... Well, we can take we can take some 50-50s. I mean, I could, like, Arcane Missiles first or Hero Power first. Yeah, actually, let's just rip the Arcane Missiles. It's pretty good. To, it's got a good chance, right? Nice, okay. That's fine. We lose a little bit of value, technically, but that's all good. So, yeah, I mean, we can just weave this in again. I mean, is, is Headcrack the play? They're getting really low. I just removed a ton of armor. Maybe Tempo off this is a little better for us. Kind of don't want to use my arcane spells until I have to, but <laughs> this I, I think I have enough, me. right? Yeah, let's just wait. 3-3 three, is worth a little more than the head crack, right? It's body on board and the two damage, so. Okay, this is looking good. 13. Plenty of arcane spells left. Arrow power is firing on all cylinders, even without wildfire. Really good. Oh my, okay. Oh my. Uh, do I have lethal here? That's check number one, I guess, right? Uh, that's five, eight, ten. How much mana is that? Five mana, so the head crack's not quite there, but that would only be 12 anyway. Let's start with the spell damage then and see what happens, because that can definitely change our fate. Um, <laughs> is this lethal? Three... Three, six, nine. Not quite, right? <laughs> Do I take the 50 50 here or just take the guarantee? I think we just take the guarantee. I I'm in no hurry. We have plenty of damage. Like, we're just going to take the safe bet on this one, I think. Take the safe bet. Here. Nine and four is lethal. Did you check mana? I feel like I didn't have enough mana. Everybody's saying missed it, but. Mm, was there enough mana? Yeah, I mean, Arcane Discounts don't actually always hit what you want them to. I had... Oh, gross. No. No, don't heal. Shoot, that's actually a problem. Uh, that's not a problem. Hold up. I, I'm, I'm almost certain I counted and it wasn't lethal. There are 13. I had three on board. I had to find 10 in hand. I had... Are you, I don't. Well, first off, I don't know if people are saying before the spell damage minion or after because I committed two mana to the spell damage minion. Um, Frostbolt plus... Ignite plus Headcrack plus Arcane Guy is the outs. But is that enough? This is also... No head crack. Oh, Shadowcaster's fun too. Yeah, that's, an that's another fun lethal. Uh, I gotta go back. Ignite three. Why is Ignite dealing three? Why is Siphon dealing three? Oh, you're saying after spell damage. The Frostbolt was still two. Siphon was one, I think, is three. And Ignite was maybe two or one. Three plus four plus three is 10. Yeah, and he was at 13 for the three on board. Yeah, I, I buy it, I buy it, I don't know. We got there. I thought I counted after the Thalnos and it wasn't, but maybe I was looking at the head crack instead of the Ignite or something. I don't know. This is a high quality pool, but what do we want? I mean, this is an arcane spell. How does this work? <laughs> I can I can copy their big thing and then transform it. That's actually pretty sick. I like that a lot. That's fun. I gotta take a pee break, guys. I'll be right back. Uh, oh, actually, let's pick a spell first. This is a good arcane spell. One thief's good. Combustion's fine. I like that. This deck is a quick 4-0. Oh. Man. Feels insane so far, too. Who needs devolving missiles? Why did we run that? <laughs> we just have sheeps on our own, man. That's overkill. Uh, I think we hard mole for wildfire, actually. Yeah, especially against this deck with a bunch of two twos, potentially. First flame's kind of like a bad wildfire. It's fire spell. It's one mana. It does two damage, but not on our hero power. 
Okay. Good damage. Reflections can be fun, too. That can steal games. Tasty Pumper says, Regis, I really need you to say my name so I can send the VOD to a friend. Well, Tasty Pumper, here's a nickel, and you've got your wish. Tasty Pumper nickel. All right, hit, hit this one twice, and then hit this one twice. I'm not going to waste the first flame yet. I think it's too early. Oh, almost. Job's done. Just setting up for next turn. It's all good. It's all good. <laughs> Wildfire. God, Wildfire would just farm this deck, dude. <laughs> I'm like, I'm so, I just want to see it. It's going to get nerfed, I feel like. I just want to see it. That feels like that might be first flame worthy. It seems like they coined that out with with, <gasps> with shenanigans in tow. I'm Okay, I'm just going to go now. There's a pretty decent chance we kind of finish off this, or at least a lot of the minions anyway, so. Hit this twice. Ah. This can't actually uh, buff itself, so. If, uh, they think it's all have something that summons other minions, but regardless, we're farming hero powers now. Now we're in biz. I dare you to make two twos. We can clean up with first flame two as needed. I could go ancient reflections, but I don't have any any nature spells, right? <laughs> it would be insane if I had even just one nature spell. It would actually be crazy. Um, God, it's not bad anyway with like arcane, but I just don't have any nature spells. These got big though, man. This is gross. Good set like this to two or this to two. I don't have any other arcane spells is the problem here. Let's start here and just see what we find. Probably gonna end up just hero powering and figuring it out later. Wow. Okay. I think I still hero power this turn and then next turn we we clean this up. Hopefully we hit the two two at least once here, but if not, we'll just try to tidy up. I don't know, this is getting a lot bigger though is the problem. I don't know, man. Need a nature spell. Rogue does technically have nature spells, right? So, oh god, dude, that's a nature spell too, right? Something's getting buffed. So three is kind of a weird breakpoint. The problem. I can put this to three. Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll figure it out. This getting hit. I can. I guess I could go stab and then I'm very, very likely to just deal with everything because I, I could really break my chain here if I'm not careful, right? Yeah, I better do that just to be safe. Dude, this <laughs> this is now dealing three twice. <laughs> All right, farm. Nice. That was the important one. Okay, sweet. Dude, that is such an insane turn, dude. That's so gross. I don't like a ton of face damage. I did nine face damage and cleared the board by hitting one button, dude. What? This has to change. This is so broken. Uh, give me another one. Give me another one. I want another one. And now if they don't play minions, my hero power just deals six damage face. Like, just every turn. How gross is that? Give me another one. Give me another one! Oh, that's sad. It's not another one. Save this for a uh, silence, right? A sheep. Okay, six damage face button. It's pretty good. Can't complain. Yeah, refresh instead of automatically retarget. That would help, I think. I like that. I think that would make a big difference, yeah. So you have to spin the mana a second time. Would still offer some, some big turns, but... Would, uh... Uh... I mean, I'm pretty much always hero-powering. See what's in the swindle, I guess. I, I don't know. Not super worried about this, regardless. I think I think Mordresh is gonna be ready next turn. What do you What do you guys think? <laughs> God, they're almost dead. I didn't think about maybe killing them. I could have probably killed them, honestly. Um, jeez, because the the hero powers landed right, so that I weaved in extra face damage. I dealt twelve face damage. Because the six at the end, and I weaved in three extra both times. That would have just been lethal. This is so insane. This is so insane. Galactic Tater, dude, thanks for the eight months, man. 
the seed, Lord. Yeah, so you should actually test hero power first to see if you weave in the extra three. Because you're not guaranteed to get that right. I basically, I, I staggered the, the minion hits with face hits, but sometimes you hit two minions in a row and it won't deal as much. But man, what a gross deck. What a gross deck. Unbelievable. It's so broken, dude. It's so broken. Party portal. Yeah. I definitely don't need Kyrie or Kobold, though. So portal's it. That's fine. Counter spells arcane, but the other two suck. They suck. Yeah, we're good. We want wildfire. We'll keep my apocalypse. That turns into a lot of cards and mana. So otherwise, look for look for wildfire. But. <laughs> Dragon Affinity and Draconic Dream. Woo! Might need some uh, arcane spells to deal with all that stuff, huh? Yeah, let's wait. They have heals, so it's something to keep in mind. Hero Power is not going to do super well against big dragons, but arcane can help shore up that weakness. Also, this could cheese a win, so let's see. Glyph into Wildfire. Yeah, there are so many things. In duels, yeah. I I seriously have like three months of content. It's gonna be impossible to keep up with everybody else because I got standard, I got sunken city, I got duels, I got everything. Like this weekend, I'll be pivoting over to standard stuff with all the new sunken city cards, so I won't have time to duels this weekend. Yeah, I really hate to waste um, an arcane spell. I I think I need to maximize those polymorphs, so I'm just gonna tempo the one two. Maybe play it next turn or something. Who knows? Could go Ancient Reflections on it and blow people up, but I, that's unlikely to be any good. Probably just go here and here next turn. Four in the tank. Warder's pretty gross. It's pretty risky for me from an Arcane standpoint, too, because this might be what gets Polly. And I could Hero Power first to try to get rid of that and then Polly, but it does limit the chain of Hero Powers. That said, of course, I think I would prefer... A one win left over than maximum efficiency or whatever. Mm, an extra minion. That's where wildfire would start looking good, huh? Be quick. Maybe I still go Panthari here though. I don't really have to hurry. Not in a big, big rush right now. If I can like maybe soften this up or kill the two one, that'd be nice. Hey, nice. We did both. Cool. Question a little awkward on the can't be targeted, eh? Yeah, hands a little light. I need to, I think I need a big ancient reflections here. Maybe even to like draw a bunch of cards. Honestly. A little bit a little bit weak at the moment. So now we got two good cheap targets. I guess this one's probably better, honestly. Combustion's not bad on that though. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Sap or just more damage with Frostbolt? Ugh, I don't really like any of these. I think Sap has pretty low utility in our deck because we can cheap stuff pretty well. I guess Frostbolt's more fitting for us, but it's just really hard to deal damage at this stage, too. We're a little early for that. Blade Furry is, is definitely not it. I also said Blade Furry, which sounds really funny. <laughs> um, okay. Oh, that's a low roll. Really wanted to snipe that so I could get another sheep next turn. Uh, I think we'll wait then. It's fine. I might need a big reflections to win this game. We're just kind of light on output here. <sighs> I mean, I, the three six isn't really that good of a sheep target anyway. <laughs> How excited am I for the new set? Very excited, yeah. I think Colossals look really cool. That's the style of card I love. Big, crazy threats and bombs and stuff. Um... I think the setting grew on me a lot. I was really worried about the under the sea setting. Under the sea. But uh, <laughs> it's grown on me a ton. It looks way cooler than I expected. Has nobody commented on how the Hunter Colossus and the one from your video were almost the same? A lot of people have. Yeah, it was cool. He definitely nailed the flavor. Be quick. Like the mechanic. Not the numbers exactly, but the mechanic for sure. Okay. Party portal. Ancient Reflections. That ain't it. Uh, we can try this, though. The question I have here is, do I want to Hero Power first? Like, this will... Yeah, we've seen it sheep a sheep. We know it'll sheep a sheep. So, I don't think so. I might want to spend this mana. 
on like combustion or something too, right? Hopefully we just hit the right target. Just don't hit that. That's the right target. Okay, cool. Yeah, we can go Thalnos combustion here. Not that we need the, the Thalnos, I guess. But what else am I going to spend the mana on? Well, I'd rather use that for burst damage later though, wouldn't I? Yeah, let's just do this. It's fine. We got a little boar bonus. Everything has one health. And I need some card draw desperately. I am so out of stuff. This hand goes nowhere fast. This isn't a terrible reflections target because it can just, you know, theoretically be sticky and annoying, but it's not good. I'd rather have either card draw or something that's just super high value. Thalos Reflections actually is, you're right. That's pretty crazy damage output, isn't it? My God, it's like a Mally goes. That's seven plus 11 plus 10 is 21 plus uh, 10 is 31 damage plus it's lethal actually this is insane it's usually lethal maybe always lethal now I have a million mana oh no I actually need seven mana right because I got five six seven eight I don't think the small ones get me there right seven spell damage so 11 plus so crazy. 10 is 21, 31. Yeah, we're not there. We're one mana off. We need eight. So we can just kind of chill in the meantime. Uh, if they build a bigger board, though. Oh, true. If I do hit arcane discounts, but I only have one, so it could whiff. There's actually a decent so chance. Oh, well, two. It just might work. I think I'm fine to wait, right? It's not super likely, but let's just wait. What's the hurry? What's the hurry? I'm just gonna hit it, you're right. Let's just hit the arcane discounts. Dude, it hit the it hit the agent, guys. I hit one of these two. Oh my god, I hit the agent twice! Ah, I hate you guys! I hate you guys so much! Ah. It hit the agent twice. I hate you guys. <laughs> I really hate you guys. Oh, man. The good news is we have a lot of card draws, so we'll probably find what we need, but I'm annoyed nonetheless. Super annoyed. Yeah, Reno is coming. Yeah, he's banned, but I guess he's available now in buckets, right? Or maybe he always was. I don't know. Be pretty unlikely, though. So they're at 11. Surely I have 11 here, right? A 10. Do I actually have 11? Oh, uh, Mordresh is one off. How much mana is that? Five. Yeah, that's that's fine. Okay. <laughs> I can't believe we hit the yes, I Oh, that's why it was good damage too, actually. Yeah, we had a lot. We had one too. All right. Cool. If you do 12 and 0, can you show a nipple? Yeah, you can see Finley's nipple right there. See that little dark smudge? Right there is Finley's nipple. Oh, it got covered up. Sorry, but right there is Finley's nipple. I'm going to keep reflections, but I might actually still hard mole for uh, wildfire. It's really good against the zero power in particular, right? Otherwise, hard mole. It's not really a hard mole if I'm keeping a card, but you know. Right there. You didn't say, can I show one of my nipples? You said, can I show a nipple? So I delivered. Murlocs have nipples, confirmed. Oh, reborn paladin. And he's far along in the run, too. That's actually really cool. I think this sticks, right? The only thing is I'm probably going to be hero powering next turn. So does it matter if it sticks? No, let's wait. That's not that scary. Um, I have nipples, Greg. Can you milk me? It's the only movie quote I know about nipples. <laughs> That's it. That right there is the famous one. Everybody knows that one. Oh, that's kind of brutal, man. I'm about the reflections, this 1-1 one, one poisonous guy. This guy is literally out of cards already, man. I think this is worth it. generates resources and they are out of them. Surely it's hard to maintain the reborn consistency in duels when you're drafting stuff that's not often going to be reborn, right? Seems really hard. Party portal coin agents, not terrible, but this poisonous stuff like can test that. Sir Finley. 
Wait, what? It's active. I don't want it to be active because I don't want a hero power. I cannot believe this is actually active, but I don't I don't like that. It's bad. It's actually bad that it's active. Um, I might still go party portal. I could I could pop off the poison this year with the agent. I mean, he's got other good hits, too, though. Yeah. What's our hurry, I guess? I don't know. Okay. We like Flame Ward a lot, and people probably aren't expecting it yet in duels because it's newly added. It does live now. Oh, gross. What a hand! What an actually insane hand that was. You're gonna finish on a card, that's the one to finish on. My god. Uh, hey, Chozo, dude, thanks for the five. Thanks, man, that's awesome. Thinking about reflection things that five three just to get some stats back because this guy pulled so far ahead. You know, can coin a hero power too. I'm gonna do it. I think it's right. Just need to get some stats in play. Don't need anything fancy here. Uh, that didn't help. Maybe I should have hero part first, actually, huh? Yeah, I don't, I don't know why I wouldn't. I could have coined hero power first and then tried to hit a better polymorph target. Yeah, I guess you want you want an extra 1-1 on board, though. So now nah, maybe it's fine. Probably the same difference. OK, they're just going to go face. I get it. They're kind of all in at this stage. Makes sense. I actually can't really do much, unfortunately, because I've locked up my board temporarily. But hopefully spells will keep me in the in the game until then. Um. Do I just put a lot of stuff to one here? It's not bad, probably. It's just making room on my board too, right? Oh, that doesn't go to one. That's getting summoned off that. Oh, whoopsie. It kind of worked out beautifully anyway. I'm a genius. Just... Just, just an actual genius, dude. Dun Baldar on the summon there counts, huh? On Reborn. Good to know. Good to know. Actual Hearthstone genius where you just killed it. It worked out so perfectly. <laughs> like, it couldn't have worked out better. Oh, that's amazing. Work guys, a good face push. I got a ton of Murlocs. Oh my god, dude. Look at this guy. Look at this freaking Hearthstone player, man. Uh, okay, so I just need some board space really here. Play a thing and then Evis, basically. Let me work my magic. And then he's totally out of gas. I mean, I can't imagine he's going face a lot more from here, right? This guy's All right. I mean, I, I, there, there's definitely ways to get face damage, so I'm, I'm a little scared, honestly. I'm a little nervous. More dress should be coming in for a win soon, though, because I'm hitting for like nine per turn for a couple turns, plus whatever hero power does. Oh, my God. What an insane top deck. This guy's no wonder he's at six wins. His deck is garbage, but he always draws the perfect card. He drew everything is awesome. Now he's drawing his 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 colossal minion off the top from an empty hand. God dang it, dude. And now he gets to dredge another good card. Shoot. It's really good. <sighs> Shoot. I need to I need to hit a good like <sighs> Which is better here to go for like should I hit this and then hope that the missile snipes it? So that I get my sheep on the four or five, right? Man, so cool, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm actually thinking about swapping hero powers because Mordresh is kind of done anyway. So it's like, I don't know if this is the best way to do this or not because it can still whiff pretty hard. I don't know. I think it's the safest way to do it, right? Hit here once, please. Once, please. Once. Oh, this is gonna get transformed. I'm gonna lose. Oh, I got bailed out. Okay. Nice, okay, okay. I think I'll be fine. The question is, do I play this or not? I think I'm going to. We got the Mordresh. I don't have Wildfire. So getting a good, like, defensive hero power here. 
Alternatively, just a more aggressive one. I mean, another aggressive one's fine, too. Maybe weapon's better, though. Depends how much mana I think I have, right? I mean, that's a meaty draw, but it's it's still relatively easy for me to deal with, at least. That's good news. That's important. Now the 8-8 will help me win, right? Secret Pass is also a fantastic draw. So now I need to find 9 damage, or actually 6 damage next turn for... A list of shots shouldn't be too hard. Oh, that's gross, though. Oh my god, you're actually joking. How do I top deck like this guy? So, I don't have lethal, right? Like, this gets me 13, but I can't send it all face. So I just have to clear two of these. Like, uh, I don't... I think I secret pass, but I have to do it at the end, obviously. If these didn't have divine shield, I'd be okay. Oh, arcane spell first. That's a good point. Yeah. Oh yeah. Transform's good. Yeah. You're right. Yeah. 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 Arcane spell is good. That saves me one. Yeah. So now I can fully clear again. Could maybe have a lethal, but I'm not gonna try that. Just gonna play it safe. I mean, I can. No, I'll just pass it next turn. We're fine. We got nine. It's all good. I'm not gonna take risks, right? We're just we're just really flying here. This should be fine. Dude, this guy is top decking like a god though. I mean he literally no. He didn't hit a like a, an out, right? Oh god, dude. <laughs> Drawing the Anoyo into banana split on your Abalgum. Like, good god, dude. What an actual mad lad. Okay, Royal. Oh, this is Arcane spell, but it's kind of wacky. I don't really like it. It's like I make them a bigger thing just to transform a thing, but I don't like these either. I don't want to put this in my deck. It's bad. I'd rather find my cards. This I don't really synergize with very well. So it probably is this. Just a free single target polymorph sometimes, right? Okay. Oh, that guy just drew so well. It's not a bad bucket, but it's not wildfire, and therefore I don't think it's worth it. We're looking for wildfire. Reno is free. Yeah, he's free. Oh, wildfire. Yes. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Okay, spell damage. Got it. Sweet mother of Murlocs. I tip my hat to you. I tip my hat to you. That's my hat. Four damage. We can still lose this, guys. We don't have a lot of cards. They may not have a lot of minions to farm this up. I mean, Mordress certainly looks pretty nice, too, though. For being honest. I wonder what that is. Plagiarize? Eight damage already, though. That's pretty good. Growth. That's cool. This is just a race, man. I guess I feel pretty good about our odds of winning said race. Like, do I want to spend my mana? Am I trying to end this game on turn eight? I, I think sometimes, yeah. Also, just want to learn a little more about that secret, perhaps, like plagiarize or something. I don't know. I don't have a good way to combo this right now. It's what I'm kind of hesitating on all that. Primordial Glyph becomes an interesting way to combo that. It's a mage secret, so we can probably... Honestly, I think I'll go Devolving here. Kind of want this to go away to be super sure. And this is a little bit safer to test for like a counter spell. Hit here, hit here. Nice, okay. Oh, we missed. That's sad. Not that those are particularly threatening though. It's Priestess Valish. New legendary, guys. She's in the zero mana pool. That's cool. I said a rhyme. How fun. 10 damage fireball. Holy crap. Holy moly. This is a close race, actually, guys. Um, Do we know what the... Is that like an explosive runes? Do we know anything about that? I sure don't. I don't really need to play this, though. There's just no advantage, I don't think. Hmm. I save this for the polymorph and discount. I mean, I, I could hit the Mordresh, right? And play it next turn. 
If I go here, actually, I can even I can even more likely do that. Could be an ice block, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna risk I'm gonna risk this because I want to discount that Mordresh to seven. There's a decent chance I can. Uh, this is also good damage, right? Yeah. Hit it, nice. Okay, sick. So if it's not ice block, we should have a lethal setup. Yeah, I doubt it's ice block as well, but we actually did hit an ice block earlier this run, so it's not impossible, that's for sure. Wow, dude. They are just going in. I mean, I... I, uh... I gotta try. It's a race, man. Woo! <laughs> dude, I don't know. Waiting one more turn might have screwed me. That, that discount might have won the game. We were low. That might have been the play that saved it. That 50-50 to discount Mordresh, man. That was a big deal. I don't think we need this. Woo! Woo! <laughs> we both just said, screw you, I'm going face. <laughs> I feel like that hero power definitely feels weaker than this one, though. For what it's worth, this one feels completely bonkers unfair. Doesn't your passive never reduce things to zero? Oh, actually, uh, that's a good... No, I think it can reduce things to zero. Oh, yeah, you might be right if it's not less than one. Oh, you might be right. It might have been guaranteed. Yeah, you might be right. Yeah, actually, was it guaranteed? Because the zero mana siphon mana was in hand. The other one was already one mana. Oh, my God. Is that why we hit SI7 twice? Yeah, that is why the SI7 got hit twice. You guys, you guys, yeah, you guys led me astray. Reno versus Reno. Yeah, you guys led me astray, dude. You guys told me it was never lethal. I mean, I think it's actually still the right play for the record. It was a really good play. Uh, but you guys did. You led me astray. It was still the right play because they could have built a board and denied the arcane missiles. And drawing cards was a great backup plan. Like, it worked out great, but... It was always SI7 because everything else was already one mana or zero mana, right? Nothing was the original two cost, I don't think. Oh, new board, dude. Oh, sick. New board. Yeah. Tradable's good. How is this cannon going to fire underwater, guys? Come on. It can't. Oh, a stairway. Job's done. Have you guys seen other people play with the board yet? Do we know secrets? I feel like one of these coins should be pick upable. Nothing's happening. Guys, nothing's happening. Job's done. I forgot his treasures. What are they? Oh god, I oh god, I was looking at what are his treasures, guys? I honestly don't know. What are his treasures, guys? I was looking at the board like an idiot. I got distracted by the shiny things. Okay, is there no way to get that out of there? Yeah, sheep? Okay. Sheep and what? Nothing to do here. Shrinking and sheep. Shrinking. Robes of shrinking and sheep. Okay. Got it. Man, big damage output. This is just, everybody just says, screw you, I'm going face these days, man. It's going to be tough for us, I'm afraid. We're good at dealing damage, but only in specific scenarios, right? Ha, this guy's toast. Oh, those turned into coins this time. Okay. There's got to be a way to fire this. Oh, it just shoots bubbles. Bolvar, four dragon off astral portal. Now that's pretty funny. Um, good chance to glyph, I guess. I don't have weapons. None of these are that useful. I guess Lunar Cannon, Cannon has the most utility, but also seems a little iffy, doesn't it? Rundorb's not bad. Hit, please. Ugh. Even one damage could make a big difference here. I'm not happy that missed. Hey, Trudius, what's up, man? This board is too blue. It definitely does have a blue vibe to it, yeah. One of the more strong color grades, I'd say. Oh, that changed. Fun. Yeah, 
It definitely has like water kind of on the edges here too. Probably one of the more dramatic boards we've seen, I think, yeah. Okay, can I pull this out? Oh, Mordrash does give me some interesting lines. So Guild Trader, not bad this turn. I kind of need the hero power leading into Mordrash though. I need this to hit so that Mordrash is done. Really need this hit a minion. Okay, nice. That finishes Mordrash. If I go here, I'm dealing six. Maybe here. No, we wait for that for next turn, right? Five, six, seven. Into Mordrash. How much would that be? Four plus six is ten. Plus six is sixteen. It's not enough yet. Shoot. Maybe this lives? Probably never. It probably always gets polymorphed, right? None of these damage cards are fire spells. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I don't I don't know. We're way behind on damage race here. Mordrash is seven now and finished, so I can clear a board, but it doesn't set me up for the win just yet. I need them to stop going over the top, dude. And, and the, dude, this deck is just all damage, isn't it? That's all they do. My god, at least ours has a little bit of minion relevance. They're just saying, nah, screw you, man. I got face damage only. That's all I care about. <gasps> no! Come on! I got another minion and everything! No! Well, that's sad. Now I gotta find a lot more damage, huh? Really sad news, dude. I'm very sad. I mean, I guess it's some consolation that they didn't really kill me. So I do have a lot of damage left still. 12. 14. 16 if it's perfect here. Oh god, more face damage. How do they get only face cards offered in their buckets, man? It's crazy. <laughs> they just only get face cards, dude. <laughs> what on earth? They don't get anything else? Really? This might be a decent puzzle box opportunity for me. I'm probably just dead next turn, though. Man, it seems like they don't miss. They only get... No. No. What is this? Oh, interesting. Do they actually have one? They do. Wow. wonder what that is, then. Uh, Ignite's not lethal for me, right? I have... Uh, it's five mana, seven mana for 12, 14, or 16, 17. So no, not lethal, right? Even if this hits, it's still not lethal. Probably a barrier here. Yeah, secret was our, oh, it's Arcane. It can't be barrier. So it's probably a counter spell or, yeah, I don't know. It, it double popped this. We know it's Arcane. Throw this way in case it's counter spell, right? Another wind portal. Okay, that's fine. That's kind of fine. Kind of hoping for something that magically healed me here. <laughs> I, needed, I needed something that just magically healed. Um, I guess I gotta get this body down. I don't have the lethal setup, do I? Oh, I actually do. It's 12 plus 4 is 16, 17. Yeah, if I'm alive here, I actually win next turn. It's just gonna be really hard to be alive here at seven, but they're kind of out of stuff. They had so much burst damage. Do they really have more? There's no more dresh on eight. I did do that math right, right? Six and six is 12. Plus four is 16, 17. It's actually only sometimes, isn't it, man? Well, that was not an arcane spell. So that could be, that could be well, counterspell number one. Oh no, it's not counterspell. It's never counterspell. Could be barrier though. I think I'm guaranteed to win, unless it's block. I think only block can beat me, right? Or maybe runes, explosive runes? Nice. Sweet! I think block was the only thing there, right? Maybe? 
I didn't have to attack with the minions, so it didn't really matter any otherwise. Oh my god, dude. Yeah, arcane spell. Sure. I dig it. Yeah, explosive friends. Maybe I should have played the 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 one thief first, actually. Huh. Yeah, if it was runes, I could have played the one thief first, huh? I think I had mana, right? So it wouldn't have mattered. Uh, a little bit of stall here. That sucks. That kind of sucks, right? I think we go here. Yeah, let's look for for uh, wildfire. <laughs> Never be afraid. Of Never be afraid of your inner power. Robe of the Magi for spell damage plus three. Screw me, silly. I haven't seen that in a hundred years. Wow. Dude, what? What? This is spooky. No overload. Spell damage plus three. Rip indeed, yeah. Double spells. The chill eight damage lava burst on turn one. Great, that's what we wanted to see. So exciting. I'm gonna need some kind of reflections cheese, I think, guys, I don't know. This is very spooky. I need them to play what? Like, I don't even know what it would be. What could I possibly cheese well enough here? Never be afraid of your inner power. The double ignite train could help, maybe. Job's done. I think hero power is just too slow here, maybe. Need to find cheese. Well, I'm technically ahead in this race at the moment, but boy, am I scared. What would be the play? What would be nuts? Like some kind of spell damage, maybe something. I mean, I create my own spell damage, too, so this is another out, but... Yeah, Torch every turn would be good. We can go for Thalnos again here, maybe. Need more mana usually for it, though. But I can grab it on a, a earlier turn, so... Next turn, we should probably try to weave this in. Torch? Okay. Interesting. These are too expensive. But I can play the Phoenix now and set it up on the... Well, wait. If I... If I Reflections the Phoenix, does it... Does it go dormant immediately or not? Chat. The others go dormant, I think, right? Which is too slow. I, I think I gotta go here. I think they go dormant as well, chat. I agree. I agree. I need to like save some burst damage. I don't know, man. This may be the wrong guy. What was the other guy? I I I didn't even really look at the other guy. Did he have stealth? That might have been better. It's kind of risky too, but might have actually been better. Hero power here is fine. I don't like them healing, but it's not that big a deal. I just need to accrue enough damage now. This is 610. It was mini mage, stealth one. Is he more expensive or the same as this guy? Yeah, stealth at one health isn't isn't worth it though, because there's too many AoEs in Shaman, right? That's I think that's too risky. This was probably the right call. Alright, let's try to snipe a hero power. If not, we'll ray of frost it just to chill for a turn. Dump a delinquent to get some uh get some stats in. Might ray of frost this anyway, just because who cares? How much is this frost bolt just on its own? Not not enough. Ten. This is another ten. Twenty. So we have quite a ways to go. Maybe we hold this. There might be bigger threats. I'm not worried about a two three right now. I need cheap damage, right? Because I, I got a six mana combo here. That's that's too much. I need one mana spells and stuff. I'm probably gonna rip the torch early, honestly. I got this. I just have to rip the torch early. That taunt's actually pretty frustrating. Because I want to go face. No good cheap arcane option here, though. Combo want thief makes a lot of sense. Let's see. Maybe wasting that freeze, but I just want to start cheap here. Arcane overflow is actually really nice. Yeah, really good. Yeah, like I said, we wasted that freeze technically, but it's worth it for three face damage. Yeah. And we polymorph that guy, which is a bonus. Ooh, and Reflections getting cheaper is nice as well. Okay, so now this is 5 plus 4 is 9 mana for a 20 damage combo. So we're getting close. Getting really close. If it's board could stick, that'd be nice. <laughs> Polymorph the wrong minion? Um, You're right, I did. I absolutely did Polymorph the wrong minion. Yep. I kind of didn't think about it, but you're right. I could have a 5-5. Five, five. Instead of a 3-3. Three, three. Yep. 
I was thinking about the taunt, but it doesn't matter. It's not in the turn. It's right away. Hex? Yeah, okay. It's really not that bad. Protects my 3-3, which should be a 5-5. Five five. As you also readily acknowledge. Okay, this makes my stuff cheaper, and it's only things I care about, so that's really good. Another arcane spell actually makes stuff cheaper, but this is just cheap damage, and it can go face. So this sets up lethal, actually. Yeah, this is good. I don't have it now, do I? Very close, because this hits the torch, so that's four, six, seven. Very close to lethal here. But we should have it next turn, no problem. Should have it next turn, no problem. Oh, board space as well. Yeah, you're right. That's another issue. Um, I actually need them killing my stuff. I don't know the best way to achieve that, though. <laughs> I need them to clear my board. And then they're dead. Probably don't need them to clear the full board now that I have three... plays. Five, seven, eight. Yeah. I have... So, like... Uh, I need 24 divided by 3 is 8. So I just need 8 each instead of 10 each, which means I only need 5 minions. So this is fine. Plus I can trade in a 1-1, one, one, so should be okay. Yeah, I could always be dead. I mean, there's no... That's always a thought. Oh, that's fine too. More board space is good. Mana commitment that's not face damage is good. This shouldn't matter... That doesn't matter. Sweet! Okay, cool. This deck wins in the weirdest ways. Oh, well. A little bit of mana left. Lightning Bloom and heals. <laughs> be the only scary thing here, I think. This deck wins in crazy ways, man. Cool! Fun! 10 and 0! Oh. Primordial Studies, I was really hesitant to add it, but it's very much bailed us out of a lot of games. A lot of games. We don't need those. Probably look for Wildfire. This is good because it, it turns into two, I guess. Oh, baby, baby, baby. <laughs> there it is. All right. The race is on. Let's go. Who cares about the board? Who cares about minions? They got Crystal Gem and Ring of Black Ice. Whoa! They might have more free stuff then. That's crazy. They must be riding their hero power. Because I don't feel like that's a particularly compelling uh, combo of treasures. They must just be farming hero power. I don't know how that's good enough otherwise, right? Doesn't feel that good. Uh, I guess we don't know if that was arcane. This deck doesn't tell us any arcane stuff. I don't really want to play this till I need to, right? I was going to play it to find the wildfire, but for now, no real hurry there. Oh, gross, dude. No, dude. <laughs> Somebody start mapping it out, guys. Who's going to win? Who wins first? I guess he wins first, huh? We're only hero powering. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Nobody's playing other cards. This is ridiculous, dude. It's actually ridiculous. Nobody's playing other cards. Uh, I mean, what on earth do I want here? It's kind of cool with like more dress later, maybe or something. I don't know. Uh, let's just wait. Trump approves of this game. <laughs> uh, okay. Decent target for some shenaniganery, I guess. Um, I guess we just first flame it, right? And then... Then hero power. Bonus damage if it lands, right? Do I really need the card here? Not really, but what else am I going to do? I don't want to swindle because I burn. Oh, runes, okay. Interesting. That does deal three extra damage to me, but not the end of the world. Okay, let's just wait. This game is really close, isn't it, man? I might need to find some damage soon to, like, push this into the next level. I got a little extra because of the minion clear there, right? Basically got that free hit. <laughs> this is ridiculous, isn't it? Oh, that's extra damage. I can freeze, though, for a turn at least. That's not bad. 
If I go party portal, it can kind of fuel their hero power in a weird way, right? If I play a bunch of small stuff, so... I don't think I do, actually. I don't think there's any need to. Can dump this as needed, right? So... Okay... So that's six, ten. Can try to find a lethal maybe, but I just don't think we're there yet. I think I need two turns at this rate. Um, dude, this is the most, this, this is the stupidest, most degenerate game. None of us are doing anything except hero powering. It's so ridiculous. I don't want to play the Mindpocalypse until I'm digging for exactly lethal, right? Because I might give them outs if I do. I don't want to give them any more damage than I have to. So I'm just kind of trying to chill for a bit. Don't be wildfire, please. No, 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 no. Oh, mage armor is great for them. Wow, that just changed this game dramatically. I don't have lethal at all for sure now. There's no way. Probably just dying here in that case. Can I even set up for next turn, right? Like, I just can't play minions, I think. Gives them a chance to do extra damage. I mean, I guess one of these is kind of free because as long as as long as it's more than two health, it's kind of free, right? You've been in tighter it's kind of free. Yeah, as long as it, so this could maybe set up a more dress top deck or a more dress my apocalypse for twenty if I'm alive. Which you know they make clear the minion. They may not. It might heal me too if it you know that could make a big difference. I guess I get a shark back as well that's just really cheap. Cost two mana. That would not enable a Mordresh, though. This Mordresh? Am I just dead? Wow. Okay. Or. Um. Cool. Oh, Quad My Apocalypse actually would. You're right. Yeah, I could play. I could play Spirit Shark and Mordrush. Yeah, that's a good point. Oh, it healed too. Okay. <sighs> Arcane missiles. I think I have to go here, right? We pretty much assume this is over. So let's see what happens here first. Is Torch enough? Six, eight, ten. <sighs> Sometimes it's enough. Oh, nice. Weave it in extra. Yes! Weave it in! Weave it in! Oh my god, yes! Might have been guaranteed at the end of the day. I don't know, but weave it in, baby. Weave it in. Woo! That was fun. 11 and 0, oh, dude. That's crazy, guys. Um, yeah, I don't want any of these. I might take Death Charger because it's literally just two damage, right? Sometimes that might help me if I play it at the end of the game. I don't know. It's fine. Yeah, we don't need those. Guys, I got to take a pee break. I'm so sorry. I'm not running an ad, so this isn't something where I'm spamming ads at the last minute for some dramatic thing. I just have to take a pee break. Give me give me 30 seconds, and we'll try to get this 12 and 0. Reno! I love the way he says, Reno! I will save Paladin! Victory. Like, quest Paladin stuff here, it looks like, maybe? Man, interesting. I'm gonna keep an arcane missiles, maybe. It's really good against one ones, right? Is that the quest? That's the quest paladin one, right? Uh, yeah. I mean, I mean, this is a good hero power against it too, theoretically, right? Melody. What if you got melody? Yeah, I wasn't expecting this. I was expecting more Reno, crystal gem, emerald goggles. Okay, so they're going fast, very fast. Paladin secret into humble blessings already. Wow. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. Oh God, I didn't test all my yog. Oh no, what have I done? I, I didn't test all my yog. Oh, I'm so lucky. Oh my God, I just had the balls of steel there. I didn't test all my yog. What's wrong with me, dude? Um, yeah, I can't I can't get in a big rush here. Hopefully we can snipe this, but if not, let's set it up for later. But yeah, turn one, humble blessings into turn two, Ysera, is a pretty nut play, I gotta be honest. That's a that's a pretty nut play. 
pretty nutso play. This guy got buffed. He's a 3-3. Three, three. Nightmare on Ysera already. Okay, I kind of dig it. It, like, shuts down my hero power. That's kind of cool, but we can just go here maybe and chill for now, right? Hoping for a good Ancient Reflections is the goal here. It, you know, they, they, they're cheesing out big stuff. If I can get something really awesome out of it, you know. Mm. I don't think that's it. That's the Battle Cry version, right? So that's not very good. Everything at three is really nightmarish for me, by the way. That was the uh, be a one damage AOE somehow. Whirlwind, whirlwind. Bestial Wrath, huh? Gross. Oh, I'm so screwed, guys. I'm just taking like 47,000 damage here. Um, I don't know. This can maybe make a few of these smaller. Or th do they stay three threes, don't they? The, even the sheep stay three threes. It's a, it's a, oh my god, it's an aura effect, of course. It does nothing. My deck is just useless against this. Oh my god, are you joking? What is this, dude? Turn, oh my god, dude. Turn one humble blessings is like, forget it. What are you supposed to do here? How can I beat this? What am I supposed to do? <laughs> Everything's at exactly the wrong health total. Do any of these have Rush that I can trade in right now? No. Zephyrus, I can't pull back into hand. Party Portal, anything cool I can do with, like, Reflections and Party Portals and stuff? Hmm. I can try to set enough of these to two. And cheese a hero power, maybe? But I don't think it's ever enough, right? I'm gonna have to... Oh my god, I whiffed on the first one. Great. <laughs> there was actually a chance if I weaved together the right hero power sequences right, it would have been perfect. Dude, The tur I've never had turn one humble blessings in my life, but it was insane. Emerald goggles. Oh my god, look at this nonsense, dude. Emerald goggles. Like, how do you, how do you get to your 12 win game, by the way? I mean, maybe it wasn't for them. They could have already lost a couple, but... How do you get to that? Well, no, I guess it would still... No, they could be like 10 and 2, I guess, right? Um, how do you get there and then hit Humble Blessings on one for your Emerald Goggles, dude? Jeez. There's no... I don't have a way to win that. What I needed to happen is Devolving Missiles to hit like a Rush Minion uh, for those life steals, so I could... Reflections, a Rush Minion. I mean, it obviously still would have only been 1-1s. One I don't know if that would have helped enough, but maybe I could have, like, put everything to 2 and got some life steal, and then hero-powered the board down. Like, there were some ways... There were some ways out, but it was really tough. Maybe if I got, like, Taunts or Divine Shields or something off the Devolving Missiles to copy, but... I think we keep Reflections, but we pass everywhere else, right? This is just a game winner. We look for Wildfire. Mm, okay. Is this the guy we played earlier with, like, the crazy burst damage outs? Yes. Oh, my God, dude. This guy's deck is nuts. We did beat him last time, of course, but it wasn't easy, as I recall. It wasn't easy. I think we went over the top with, like, reflection spell damage, right? That's how we won. Let's go ahead and plan that again, honestly. But do I save this arcane? We know he's mostly spell-based. So we could arguably save this arcane, but I don't think so. We go cheap or big? I think we go big. This is still going to be only three mana and maybe cheaper with arcane spells. That's a seven mana setup. Let's go big. It scales really well, right? Okay. Need to make these cheaper. Need more arcane spells. This hand's pretty bad, actually. Pretty dang bad. Panthara will be nice. Yeah. I need to draw. Puzzle box I can kind of rip whenever for a discount. I needed to hit one of these two, though. So I would almost rather play this stuff first, right? I might be able to shark into Panthara, but it's just so slow, man. He's going to kill me by then. Uh, Yeah, I think this might be the Thalnos Oopsie. No, I think the Thalnos Oopsie was against Priest, right? Because I was worried about them healing. They had, like, their hero power and stuff. Hey, Bjorn Winfeld. Oh, my God, dude. Thanks for the tier one subs. We got to Captain Awesome Possum, The Gunder, Skip Eye, White, and Tessa. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hopefully their hand is equally awkward. I mean, they have a lot of stuff, too, that seems like it's just not really doing much. Mana type. Man, I think I got a puzzle box that. Oh, God. <laughs> I mean, um, 
Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. I, I kind of want to go here first though because this is a higher likelihood to hit the two things I care about for arcane spells, right? Like if I do this, I might draw cards that eat the discounts. So, so right now I have two fails and two hits. So let's try to hit. Nice. Okay. Excellent. Okay, damage follow-ups are good. Chip damage is good. We're now at six mana. So we're gonna have 14 spell damage if this connects. So for instance, this will be at four damage plus 14 is 18 damage already. So I just need a couple good spells and we're good to go. Shark next turn, maybe into Panthara the turn after. Opponent hasn't even damaged me yet. So I do feel like I have a little bit of time. I feel like I have a little time. Uh, they're just not doing much. Maybe they, maybe they have a lot of minion reactive cards and I'm just not playing minions right now. Oh, whoa, give me wildfire, please. Oh, that's good. Wildfire, please. Wildfire, please. Please. Astral portal, huh? It's kind of intriguing. I, I like the discount on it. Hero power here is very unlikely to be good, but does set up for later pretty well. Eh, I'm just gonna go Astral Portal, I think, man. I don't know, Hero Power Panthara is not terrible, I guess. I'm leaving eight damage out usually, though. Imagine if I fully cleared the board with Hero Power here, guys. <laughs> it's not impossible. <laughs> um, if I go Spirit of the Shark, I mean, the SI7 is not really any better. I want to draw, but I also want to discount and just get a body that has to be interacted with, right? Like, this often gives me a body. Trade first? No, I can't trade this. I, I gotta have this. Th this is my whole combo win condition. There's no way I'm trading. Alright, I'm just gonna draw. Oh! Nice! Clearing one's good. That saves me a lot of health, potentially. Oh, um... Yeah, I want to discount. Let's do it. Nice. Not, oh, well, actually, this isn't that nice if it hits wrong. Okay, yeah, that's pretty good. Good exchange. Uh, Bjorn Winfeld with another five gifted subs. Oh, my God. Jack Standard, Cactus Jones, Quinn Hood, Dyer, Odacool. That's amazing. <laughs> Imagine if I fully cleared, guys. <laughs> it wasn't impossible, right? It was actually doable. <laughs> okay, that's gross and big. That's a lot of damage output suddenly very fast. Very rapid damage output. Any arcane spell is good against this guy, though. So this should be fine. Oh, there's two now, though. Yeah, still pretty, pretty. So oh, my God. So do we go wildfire here? It's not great math for us at the moment. It's the problem. I think I think not yet. Incrementing it in now doesn't really help me a lot, right? I want to I want to hit it on a future turn. Well, I don't know. It doesn't really hurt to play it either, right? It's It's kind of in the middle here. This Polymorph's Dominion, which I like. Am I better off hero powering or... Oh, that's a roll! <laughs> that's a roll. I think I'm better off hero powering and wild firing in the future, right? Because it doesn't really do anything this turn. I should be able to weave in the mana next turn, no problem. So I, I theoretically get more upside by hero powering now. Yeah, I mean, I do give him Poisonous, though. Well, I mean, he could get that anyway, I guess. So it doesn't matter. Same difference. Um, I guess this isn't actually that good of a roll without another minion on board, is it? It's it's a taunt, which is nice, but it, it's not very good against Poisonous, specifically. <sighs> okay, so... I just need one more damage spell, really, and we're good to go. Didn't I say this dealt 18? So, like, another one of these. Uh, I guess I need one more mana, technically. Oh my god, Pure Cold for 12, into Lightning Bolt for 7, into this for 6. Oh my god. Okay. Jeez, dude. No, it's another seven. Oh my god. Oh my god. I forgot about the plus three default. Um. Yeah, I don't have it here. Obviously. Uh. This isn't good enough. It's only eighteen. I needed one more damage spell. I don't have any way to draw except this, which I don't. I don't think there's anything that's tradable that gets me out of the game, right? The arcane discount doesn't open up any lines. Nothing off Spirit of the Shark is good enough. Copy their Thalnos? I, I don't think it's enough. I mean, theoretically, I guess it could be. If I hit the exact right spells or something, or some way to generate more stuff, but no, it's not. The problem is we just know we're dead on board, right? So Ice Block is my hope. I don't have a way to get an Ice Block, though, man. I'm just dead. 
I don't think I have any plays that are getting me out of this mess. It's a good try. Man. We had the setup just a turn slow, man. Spell damage plus three ultra rare treasure is a little hard to deal with. Cone of cold face. <laughs> of course they just have perfect board clear too. Not that it mattered. Ah, uh, if I had just drawn like an arcane missiles or something, right? We would have had it. We would have had 18 plus 17. 35 damage would have been enough. Okay. Hopefully that guy's done, man. Uh, probably exerciser can actually go face. Silence isn't irrelevant. These don't really benefit me much. I mean, I guess we do have polymorphs for silences, but it's just nine damage as well. Okay. You think Quest Hunter will be good? Yeah, it's already pretty solid, so I mean, I haven't really looked close at what it's losing yet, but... Okay. Final attempt here. Surely we can get it, right? Surely. Let's look for wildfire. Let's look for treasures. This burst damage doesn't go far enough this early, right? Uh, oh, okay. That's a good start. Probably some kind of mirror match here. Oh, Fire Reno. Whoa. Flame Elementals and uh, Fireballs. Now, the good news is we're really good at farming Flame Elementals in particular, right? So if he summons a bunch of Flame Elementals, we might just farm. That could be good news. Hey, hey, Tag. What's up, man? You don't have to say this guy. You can just say, hey, Regis. <laughs> I'm a real person. I read messages. I, I People do that on YouTube, too. It makes me sad, like... This guy. It's like, yeah, me. You can talk to me. I respond sometimes. I'm reading. I'm listening. I love you. I six damage face and clear. Like, it's so ridiculous, dude. I'm back to thinking this is broken again. Uh. I love you, Regis. Can you sign my beard? It, it, yeah, if I ever go to an event again like BlizzCon, sure. I've signed a lot of things. Books and posters and... Well, that's about it. <laughs> I guess not really that many things in hindsight. Uh, I've signed a few things, let's say. It's about all. Okay. Yeah, I think we just hero power again. I, I kind of want to hold these right for, for upside or for, for polymorphs. They're not exactly off to a rocketing start here, so let's just keep the heat coming. When do I think BlizzCon comes back? If you want my honest opinion, never. Um... <laughs> I don't, I don't know that. It's just, I don't know. Blizzard had a lot of really, really negative, um, you know, people were hurt by a lot of stuff and the audience lost a lot of trust and, and, uh, excitement around Blizzard, I think. So I worry it may never come back, at least not the way it was. Mm, yeah. Kind of light on resources, but hit, hit, hit. Nice. So much extra damage if you hit. It's crazy. Yeah, let's hold. That's that's big damage output. So, I don't know, man. BlizzCon may never come back. I hope it does. I mean, you know, they're getting a bit of a reset with the Microsoft buyout potentially and new games are coming. You know, it's been a while since there's really been a, a significant new title. So, there's been some, like, remastered stuff, but that usually doesn't go that far. So, okay. Arcane Missiles here is... Not the best polymorph target, really, but it might be the one to go for. Even if it whiffs, it still sets up better hero powers, right? Mm -hmm. Hit it once and then hit face twice would be ideal. Yes, perfect. <laughs> Just perfect. Okay, now hit the minion once. Oh, we missed the minion. No. I'd be better off keeping the minion here, though, because I can hit it next turn, right? Helps me farm it next turn. I play the agent, they can trade it in, but I also want to save these spells for the guild trader. Seven mana, it's a pretty good play. Yeah. I'm gonna go here. Maybe they'll clear the minion with something else and see, leave this up. They may not trade it in, but it's okay. There's there's more minions later too, hopefully. Okay, so this is 10 damage later with guild trader. I still have hero power damage output. That was a big whiff there. We could have dealt so much more. Well, not so much more. A little more. A little more. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, whoa. Oh, whoa. It's going face. You're kidding me. Oh, no, it's not. It's still trading. Why not buff this one, I wonder, then? Oh, maybe you couldn't. You had to buff it first, eh? Yeah, I think so. Okay. First lame sucks. That's good, though. Yeah, I don't really need this, but it's free now. Whatever. Might matter. So, we have 10 in hand for 7 mana next turn. Um, this is 6, and this is 4. Shouldn't even need hero power. We're 31. Hopefully that's enough. We killed some people from 31 earlier, though, so... I can't really trust that it is. That's fine. Spend your mana. As long as you're not healing, I'm happy. Don't play a counter spell. Your power is totally fine. Oh, 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 oh. Why would he have to buff first there? I, I thought he had to to make the trade. Was the minion at one? That that's why, but anyway. GG! We did it! Let's not play the top deck. Let's, <laughs> let's be nice. <laughs> let's let him know it was in hand. <laughs> Yay! 12 wins! This is so busted, man. I, the only things we lost to were some of the most broken things I've ever seen. Plus three spell damage for 80 million damage and turn one humble blessings is the only thing that could beat this deck. It's just completely insane. Totally busted. Um, kind of weird rewards, I guess. Gold cards are fine, though.